All right, Badger High School in Lake Geneva is set to play in its first ever championship game. TMJ4's Megan Lee shows us how the community is rallying around these Badgers. Oh. Shout out to Mars, best ribs in the county. <laughs> right here, our best ribs. The undefeated Badger High School football players fueling up the night before the state championship game against Wanakee. We brought about 75 slabs of ribs. There's about 50 players on the team, and I think there's maybe two slabs left over. Arnie Silvestri owns the popular supper club in Lake Geneva and donated the food ahead of the big game. These kids are really, really great kids. They work really hard. Matter of fact, three or four of them actually work at our restaurant. Arnie says this is a big deal for their small town. Some even asking for autographs from the players. The town is really, really pulled behind uh, the team. It was the first time that Lake Geneva has been to the final game. All schools in the Lake Geneva district have the day off tomorrow. The hope is to fill the stadium for the one o'clock kickoff. Camp Brindle's big, but I know a lot of people in the community are going, so I'm sure the stands will be packed. Badger fans were gearing up for the big game by picking up special spirit wear and rally towels sold by the student council. The energy within the community and the school is really powerful, so I think everyone's pretty excited. Businesses downtown are supporting the team in various ways. Champs is showing the game tomorrow for anyone who can't make it to Camp Randall. Everybody's here to support them. It's, it's, it's amazing how many restaurants, uh, buildings, uh, the, the local radio station, there's stuff everywhere for Go Badgers. A sign at the local McDonald's reads, let's go Badgers, good luck at state. This is an incredible opportunity for all of us. The team leaves from Lake Geneva at 9 tomorrow morning. They're going to gonna kick some butt. Fans are encouraged to cheer them on along Main Street. One, two, three. One, two, three. In Lake Geneva, Megan Lee, TMJ4 News.